Hello, my name is Miranda McClellan, and I'll be presenting my topic for this fellowship, using juries for community-based content moderation decisions on social media platforms. Currently, content moderation on social media platforms has a history of mixed outcomes. Here are a few headlines from controversial content moderation cases. To users, content moderation can feel like a black box. It lacks transparency in which rules were violated, seems unfair in its application to some minority groups, and is inconsistent, which lowers trust between users and platforms. So when a user uploads content that violates the rules, who decides what happens? Currently, many social media platforms use a hybrid content moderation approach. Automated moderation uses artificial intelligence algorithms trained to defect violations to social media platforms guidelines and then takes action. This is essential for efficient and scalable moderation, so users don't have to wait for another human to review every content post or comment they make before it's available. At the same time, we still need human moderators for some cases that um, artificial intelligence is not yet sophisticated enough to handle. Still, there are issues with human moderators as well. For over the 620 million unique communities and Facebook groups, only really 15,000 moderators paid globally by Facebook to moderate their content. At an even higher level, Facebook's 40-person oversight board heard only 10 out of the 300,000 cases that were brought to them in the first six months. Obviously, so few human moderators cannot represent the diverse communities and cultures they are tasked with moderating, and they can't do it at scale. So how can we empower diverse users to participate in the content moderation process? My solution is juries. After a user appeals the decision to remove their content, potential jurors are selected by an algorithm from the user base on the platform to form a jury to consider the content in context. Only users in good standing that are active on the platform, not frequently flagged for their own violation of the rules and don't participate in bot-like behavior would be allowed to vote in the jury. Consider using a system like Reddit points. And of course, jurors can decline to vote on a certain topic. The algorithm would then select members for the jury based on membership in three subgroups. First are peers, users who share the, share the same interest race profession as the original poster. Second, compatriots, users who live in the same locality or country and understand local laws. And outsiders, users who really haven't interacted with the topic or content in question. And these might represent how the average user would react if they saw the content while scrolling through their feed. Juries would then vote on four questions. First is, does this content violate community guidelines? And if yes, which so? In which case they might receive a dropdown of the guidelines to select which were violated. The next three questions help us establish rules for edge cases and how we might want to handle the, that content on the platform. Second question is, if yes, if it does violate a community guideline, should this content still be published based on cultural, historical, education, or journalistic merit that might outweigh the damage done by violating the community guidelines? Third, is this content inappropriate for children and minors? And then platforms can use the results of this question to distribute content on their platform to different user bases. And four, does this content discriminate based on sex, gender, race, or religion? or other protected classes we might want to be hyper vigilant about protecting to maintain a safe community online. Part of my project is simulating this voting experiment by creating a survey representing three content moderation cases, have social media users respond to the survey to simulate a jury and analyze if the responses match the real world decisions and view how the distribution of the results differs based on world religion, world region, gender, age, religion, um, or any other interesting demographics like preferred platform. Our desired outcomes are having users vote on their values for their communities online, Explanate, providing explanations of content moderation decisions by displaying the results of the, each of the four voting questions, increasing trust between these users and the platforms by democratizing this decision-making process, and analyzing which content is acceptable globally versus locally, so dominant cultures aren't blindly imposed on everyone. Next, jury decisions can use, be used to train AI moderation algorithms 
or redesign the guidelines human moderators use. And over the long term, we hope to see fewer appeals because our decisions are culturally correct. I'd like to ask you, who makes a better judge than a jury of your peers? Thank you.